everyone, it's Sherry Carroll for SimonSaysStamp.com and I have the May 2015 card kit reveal for you. This is an absolutely beautiful card kit and I'm going to start off by showing you the full size ink pad that we have and we've made this specifically for this kit and it will be also in our store and this is pale blush pink. The clear stamp set is titled Congratulations and it has all sorts of wedding messages and some really great icons to use for your cards. Another really great bonus in here is a set of stickers and these are from my mind's eye. These coordinate with the papers that I'll show you here in a second but they are all wedding type themed and there's also some really great gold which is so on trend for right now. So the papers that you get are all the 6x6 six six, and I'll go ahead and fan these out a little bit. They are double sided so you can see that there's some with really that great gold. I'll try to get some reflection in here for you. The colors are that pale blush pink, some grays, blacks, and also this paint chip type look with gradated color. Love those. And also some gems and really nice filigree backgrounds. I'll go ahead and flip these over so you can see the back side, which are not as gold leafed, uh, but really great coordinating papers for your card making. You will also get five sheets of the Simon Says Stamp cardstock. So to start off, you'll get smoke, slate, black, and then two sheets of the cream. So that is the May 2015 card kit from Simon Says Stamp. I have created a simple wedding card. I have a ton of weddings this year, so this kit has come in just in time for me. And I've used some of the papers and some of the stamps. Knowing that I want to make a few cards, I have put a piece of cardstock in my Misty and I've stamped quite a few of the images. So I have the little speckled type banner and I've used two tones of ink. I've used that pale blush pink and gray. Also tying the knot, congratulations. And then I've stamped quite a few of these little banners. The inks that I've chosen are the fog, smoke, and the pale blush pink for all of my little images. And to use the Misty, I've just laid my stamps in place and then inked them up and stamped down onto my paper. My card is quite simple. I have trimmed up my congratulations and I've put this onto a folded white note card. And I've also trimmed up a piece of the pattern paper and then I added a trim of that multicolored paper. So I'm just going to use some of my adhesive and then I'll go ahead and place this right onto the card, making sure that I line it up from the top. And I've cut everything so that it'll fit just perfectly. Once I have everything positioned, I'll go ahead and press that down. The next thing I've done is trimmed out the Mr. and Mrs. that is on the little white piece of paper here and I've cut that into a little banner cut on the left side and I've added some foam dots to the back. I want to lift this up just a little bit on my card. So I'll go ahead and make sure that I butt that up to the right side of the card and once I'm ready I can go ahead and press that down. To finish things off I have circle cut my little hearts and my card is complete. This is a really easy kit to work with if you do have some weddings planned this year. So I hope you've enjoyed and thanks for watching.